cloud computing is, is or virtualization is, about, is the key enabler of cloud computing. Um, you know, cloud computing right now, I think, is, is, is getting a lot of attention because of the potential that it has. Um, you know, again, uh, IT has always been under, under um, excruciating you know, pressure to reduce costs and provide a better service. Um, people want to pay for what they use. People want, need the service when they need it. They want to be able to scale when they need it and reduce that, need, you know, reduce that cost or reduce the amount that they use when, when they don't need it. And cloud computing is, is, has some of that promise that can be much more um, reactive and much more dynamic to the needs of a business. Um, and it can also provide many more services now, both to you know, consumer, as well as commercial, um, both behind the firewall and, and outside the firewall. And so virtualization is one of those key enablers. It's because of virtual, being able to virtualize uh, those applications, I can be much more nimble. I can scale much quicker. I can provision new virtual machines much faster and react to changing business needs as I grow. Uh, uh, virtual appliances is another area that's getting a lot of attention in the cloud computing environment. All right? I can implement a virtual appliance as a standalone package versus having to you know, do all of the things necessary to implement an application, the configuration, et cetera. Those all, again, are kind of coming to play in this whole realm that we're talking about with cloud computing. And then the platform itself, you know, beyond the, that we talked about earlier that's really kind of enabled virtualization to become more mainstream um, with the lower, with again, with lower power um, and low, more power efficient platforms that, uh, that apply to this cloud computing environment as well.